welcome to the show this evening, folks. Uh, I think that many of you who have been here realize that we um, cater to all types of music. And we do a lot of rock, I know that, because <laughs> who doesn't like rock? Uh, we do a lot of current and many, many diverse types. But this evening, we're going to kind of take you on a little bit of a journey. Because this is about sound, and this is about imagination, and this is about reaching into your very soul. Now, I say this because we are presenting this evening electronic music, and I'm so proud to introduce you to David Wright. I know that we have played maybe one or two of his songs on the air before, just you know, to mix it up a little bit. But this evening, we're dedicating the entire show to David because he just at the end of January came out with an album and it's called Prophecy. And not only is David Wright involved in this, he has someone else very special who made this album with him. And her name is Carries. It's C-A-R-Y-S. And I wanted to tell you a little bit about them, and I'll probably talk a little more in between some of the music. But Prophecies, this time we find David Wright joined by Carrie. And he extended his musical palette in a degree that I think is going to surprise many of his fans. And it's clear from the title, Prophecy. It has both an oceanic and a space theme, and I love both of those. But yet neither one dominates the album, and that's rather a difficult thing to do. Now we're not gonna play the whole album for you because we, we're gonna, we pick seven songs from it, but there is many more on this. And the structure is, you know, a typical David Wright type of structure if you follow him, but the music has a little bit of a different feel to it. It's the beautiful vocal textures of Carrie's. It just adds another dimension. And the themes are blending together effortlessly to extend that they form a complete piece. One is unlikely to play only a single track from this album, let me tell you. So uh, here's Punky. <laughs> She's always ready for the show. But I wanna get on with this and we're gonna play the first song and this one is called, and let me get this right, Song of Arsenius. So here you go. Sit back and relax and enjoy. <laughs> Isn't that beautiful? I just had to get that little one in there so you could get an idea of what Carrie has brought to David Wright. And they're just the perfect blend. So anyway, I, I don't want to <laughs> take up too much time with talk because I'm ready to listen to see some more of this. And this one is called Cosmic Dancer.
have to let you know that uh, David is an expert at orchestrating simple ideas and then evolving ambience and recurring synth themes. And um, they do hold your interest. I don't know if you noticed or not, but Punky just sat there for the longest time listening to the music. And a lot of, she's usually going back and forth. So I think even the animals like this. Now, the very vocal input by Carrie's adds an almost spiritual dimension to the music. Her plaintive whale cries, as you're going to hear in this nest song, are part of the dense textured layers and as lead are stunning. While the short central spoken section is very deeply moving. So moving right along, because I get really excited about this, uh, we are going to present to you right now, Whales Weep.
I am just mesmerized by that. Couldn't you hear the whales weeping? Isn't Carrie's so talented? Um, absolutely beautiful. David, <laughs> you and Carrie's make a great duo, and I hope you come out with more after this one. Wow. So now we're going to go visit the ocean to the stars.
Okay, is it just me? Because I was hypnotized. And I'm looking at this picture from Prophecy. And am I the only one that can see like a nose and two eyes and a forehead there? <laughs> uh, I tell you, I haven't been drinking or taking anything. But I was staring at this, especially on the right. And if that doesn't look like an eye looking at you, I don't know what does. Wow. Absolutely wonderful. And uh, I want to do a quick shout out to the people that make this possible for us. And if you haven't visited them, I suggest you do. They're called AD or Ad Music. And you can find them... Um, I've got almost everywhere on the internet and um, you'll find their music under iTunes and many other outlets but they do such a great job in promoting their artists and we appreciate them coming to us and allowing us the opportunity to bring you this fantastic fantastic sound Wow okay I want a little a bit more of this because I think we're going to go deeper, deeper into the sky this time. And right there is Carrie. She's on the far left. And there's David right next to her. And these are the two people. And we're going to show a couple other pictures of them. But they're the talent behind the sound that you're hearing tonight. And now we're going to start to dive skyward because this is called Diving Skyward. <laughs> Thank you. 
I want to encourage any of you listening right now, if you haven't been doing so already, to close your eyes while these songs are being played because you're going to go places you've never been before and it's going to be so magnificently beautiful. And I don't know if you heard a little funk or not over there, but uh, Punky wanted to eat, but she's not eating until the show's over, so uh, she can just be a little bit spoiled all she wants. <laughs> But she's still sitting here listening with us, and that's what we want from her. Do you know Prophecy took over a year to record? And I can see why. Can you imagine putting all this together so that it kind of tells a story that takes you from the earth, well, even below the earth because it's the ocean, all the way up into the sky and into the universe? Mm nothing more beautiful than that uh, this is uh, some more pictures of Carrie's and David Wright and here's Punky see yeah I knew you couldn't stay away from the music very long <laughs> and the next song that we are gonna play is one that is called Serena's Rising I think we're going up into the universe folks <laughs>
Well, can't get enough of this. And I hope that you took my suggestion and are closing your eyes as you listen to this. And we have one more song from Prophecy that we're going to share with you today. And this one is called, now I hope I get this right, because you know me on names. I'm not the best one with them, but I'm going to say that it's Nephele, N-E-P-H-E-L-E. Close your eyes and enjoy the journey. have certainly come a long way from way back when when synthesizers first hit the music world and I believe that was way back in the 60s with the Moody Blues and Search of the Last Chord if I'm recalling correctly and uh, I am so happy that they 
went ahead and included that in that song because other musicians since that time have built upon it and this is the type of magnificently beautiful music that you get uh, if you get this uh, this EP this CD this album whichever you prefer you're going to sit down and listen to it and go on a wonderful wonderful journey because there are many more songs and some of these had different parts to them and we only played one part of it because we, we just don't have the time to do it all and besides we want to leave a little bit for you to listen to also I do want you to know that um, you can um, go ahead and find this music online through AD Music iTunes and it's available beginning last month which was just around the corner which was last week the 27th of January so you're one of the first people getting to hear this music uh, if there's any press out there if you have inquiries about it you can contact Elaine at AD Music and you can also email them at admin at admusiconline.com and if you want CD distribution contact New World Music because I, I think there's a lot of people who are going to find this fascinating, um, awesome. It's just sick. That's all I can say. It is sick, sick, sick. It's fantastic. Wow. So with that, I'm going to once again, Punky is right here with me again. I'm going to say goodbye for this show. And I hope you'll tune in as often as possible and share not only this show, but others with people because you can find every single one of them at it matters radio on youtube so just go to our playlist there and browse and see which ones you like and we appreciate all my little chickadees out there and as i always tell you folks you just go ahead and rock on yeah <laughs>